Hey, little Eric here, doing a review today on the old Spetsnaz cold steel shovel. It's got an edge all the way around the shovel blade. Uh, I've seen videos of people throwing this like an axe. Uh, it can fall trees, no problem. Definitely do lemon, any foliage, you can go right through foliage. You can use it like a machete. You can use it pretty much any axe, machete, survival tool, all together. Please do not go on Amazon and buy one of them $60, 75 tools in one shovel. You'll end up fucking killing yourself with a damn thing. Just depend on something basic. A basic tool will get you everywhere you need to go. This is a basic tool. A knife is a basic tool. The trifold shovel is also a very good option compared to this. It's been around forever. The GIs used it for God knows how long and they're still using it. So it's got to tell you something. But uh, I put this thing through the ringer. It seems to work very good. The one thing I like about this shovel is it has screws in it holding the handle in. No other shovel has that. This thing has it rolled over and the shovel handle goes right down in there. Nothing else. This is just one piece. No welds, no rivets, nothing. So you turn around, you break this handle out in the field, take two screws out, find you a decent handle, material, you cut it down, you put it back in, get back to work. That's all you gotta do. Other ones, you're SOL guys. I mean, this is a very nice option and it's cheap. It's around 30, $34 on Amazon. You can't beat that. But unfortunately, you have to buy the sheath separately. And I highly recommend you get the sheath because of the damn edge on this bad boy. But she will take a bite. Does not have a problem whatsoever. See what I'm saying? She bites right into that. I've used her to clear brush. It's like just swinging a machete. This thing is incredible. Um, I'm going to be carrying it more often in one of my packs. But uh, my next review, I'm going to be doing uh, one of those Faraday dry bags. See if it's bullshit or not. Uh, for $49.50, it better not be bullshit. But anyhow, total respect. Uh, cold steel for this. Definitely want to give Dave Canterbury of the Pathfinder Survival School a shout out for turning me on to this. And uh, as time goes, I'll put more of these out if you guys like it. Remember, you stay safe, stay warm, stay hydrated, and take care.